I recently went for a trip to France and I discovered a bit brand called Ibrine. This was a very interesting thing for me because first of all, I love bits. I love trying them out. I've always been a huge fan. And uh, what's interesting about these ones is that everything is interchangeable. So, so behind me, you can see there's very different colors. Each one of these colors is more or less flexible. So it just really depends on what type of horse you have. If it's a young horse, if it's a more experienced horse, if you need more control, less control. Uh, this one, for example, is one of the most rigid ones. So you can see it doesn't bend much. But then we have this one, which is more for young horses. And this is also heavy, so they can take the contact. And you can just see it bends much easier. So it's softer on the mouth. It is also very good that you can undo this and basically change the whole outer piece of the bit and the mouthpiece. So there's a lot of options with this and I find it very cool that you can play so much with one single mouthpiece or so many different cheek pieces. So this, for example, is the bit that I use with Calypso. He is my eight-year-old 140 jumper. This is just a short shank pelham with a converter and you can see it takes the shape of the mouth after a little bit which is good it's more anatomic and this is a little rigid but you can still bend it quite a lot I find it helpful because it keeps him nicely on the contact but I still have the pelham and the, the curb chain to have enough control in the ring so this bit has worked very well for me this is the bit that I use with one of my mares, Sugar. She also jumps the meter 40s, 45s. It can look a little impressive, but it's really not that bad. I also use a converter so that there's less shank. And here you can see the nose piece. So it distributes the pressure between the mouth and the nose when you pull on the rein. This here slides, which is good because it keeps movement in the mouth, but without being annoying. And it's the same mouthpiece, so still flexible enough. This is very nice to just keep enough control, but not get too much control when it's a force sensitive horse. So this has worked very nicely for me. Uh, so these bits have worked very well for some of my horses at certain periods. And it also depends whether I'm just working or competing. But as we all know, horses are individuals so it doesn't guarantee that it works on all of them but it is definitely good for sensitive horses i have found it works good for them it gives you a lot of options to play with which also kind of makes sure that you can find something that works but again horses have their own minds their own mouths so it won't necessarily work with all of them